Hey, what's up YouTube? Welcome to the channel. This is Tesla DMV. We are here on Route 66 and um, well, this is actually coming from Tyson's Corner. Um, I'm getting on Route 66 from Chain Bridge Road. That's 123 and uh, this is like the little connecting part. So notice how FSD is doing its thing about merging here. And, and this is, seems like a common issue with everyone that has um, gotten version 11 update. That's See, I actually used my indicator here and it did a pretty good job about switching lanes. But if, if, if you're just expecting FSD to kind of get into the highway like that, um, I think, you know, that would be ideal. And that's kind of what we want. And FSD is doing that, but it's not doing it like people would do it, per se. Like, you know... I would have merged into, into the highway a little differently, um, but I'm noticing that that's com kind of a common issue. Like you see how this connector road, which leads into R Route 66, just kind of is really a big merge, <laughs> if so to say. Like it just kind of this is like one big exit. So you know, this is kind of like a, a good test to show how FSD is like working on the highway. I mean, it works, which is great. I think that's phenomenal to be using FSD on 66. For me, that's cool because I, I drive on this road a lot, uh, but I would like to see improvements, of course, you know, and that's one thing that I kind of have been talking about since day one with FSD is um, not just improvements, but um, the, like the symbiotic relationship that you need with your car so to say and uh, what that means is like uh, kind of understanding what FSD is doing why it's doing it uh, what could like trip it up um, one great thing is it starts communicating with you now like there's actual text that pops up and says like oh switching lanes you know or stopping for traffic or whatever the car is doing um, which is kind of funny because that's that's kind of what I do. I, I just sort of report on what the car is doing. And I think it's funny, here we go, changing lanes into faster lane, use turn signal to cancel. So it's funny because like this thing is even putting me out of a job here, like that's AI right there for you. All right, so here we go with the exit that merges into 66. This is like the off ramp, longest exit you're ever gonna take. It's about a mile and a half long. But man, I think that was smooth, very smoothly done. I have handled that on uh, Navigate on Autopilot and it's a little swervy with um, you know that, that particular exit. And uh, I have to say that's a huge upgrade that I just noticed there. All right, so here we are, we're officially on 66 now. You know, I need to go 66 on 66. It's a pretty comfortable speed to keep up the traffic. And uh, we're running FSD on the highway here. What a great thing, and uh, it's, it's working great, as you can see. I wanna thank everyone for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, hit that like button if you did. Make sure you subscribe for more highway FSD, more inner city FSD, more rural FSD, more Georgetown Pike FSD. Um, I'm actually gonna be testing uh, other highways here soon. So really want to cover most of the DMV uh, so that we can see some of the improvements and uh, I can report to you all that FSD is safe or it's not. So far so good. It's thumbs up from me so if it's a thumbs up from you too give this uh, a video a like and uh, hope you have a great rest of your day or night if it's nighttime for you.